Um, first of all, the, the, the great thing about 24, of course, was the chance to work once again with, with, with Spencer Ernst, who is by far one of the most talented up-and-coming directors that, uh, that, that I've had a chance to work with. Uh, I enjoyed, uh, I, I, let me talk a little bit about some of my challenges on, on, in making this. The, the challenge, uh, the biggest challenge that I had with my character, per se, would be the fact that almost all my scenes were done just with myself. So working with myself, no one really to share dialogue with, that's always a challenge. But, you know, in terms of the whole experience of being at 24, a little problem with the producers. You know, first, they wanted those nude scenes, and I had to get those out. You know, luckily, that went away. They promised me 10 different co-stars, female, that were all part of People's 100 Best List. None of them showed up. I would always be prepared with my lines, but other actors didn't have the same level of preparation that I had. Uh, they'd spend a little more time in their trailers, um, you know, Luber in particular. I had already signed the contract, so I was going to fulfill my end of the deal. So that part was rough. The other thing that I really didn't like about it, I wasn't able to explore my character. You know, what do I do in my free time? No, all that got ended up on the cutting room floor. In addition, I hardly ever got out of this stupid chair. And all I ever did, talk on a walkie-talkie. You know, I'm a much more gifted actor than that. My challenge is having to put up with other actors who don't have the same level of professionalism that I have. Uh, as far as the character I play, I mean, I love my character. I was essentially playing myself. And if I don't like myself, then then we, you know, that's a problem. Uh, and if I can't play myself, then I'm not a very good actor. I can do so many things. Look at some, look at my body of work, you know, that I've done here at Lindbergh High School. You know, if this keeps me from getting a major award because of this producer and his short-sightedness, there's going to be lawsuits, there's going to be problems. You know, I got this guy into the industry and I can take him out of the industry. He better not get full of himself. That Ernst kid better watch it. But otherwise, it was a pretty good experience, and I'm happy to do it again. Thanks. Nailing, nailing Krogan with the door was cool, too. Because, honestly, I had Krogan in class and when she was a freshman. And I can't tell you how many times when she'd sit there and she'd be talking about palms or something. And I'd just think to myself, my God, I would love to nail this kid in the face with the door. Um, so, that, one of the great things about 24 is that it allowed me to, to <laughs> One of the great things about 24 is it allowed me to fulfill some of my uh, some of my dreams. So. Oh, I thought it was a lot of fun producing 24. I mean, it's basically my first major production. I mean, that's what I want to be in life, and it's a lot of fun just messing around with Jessica and everyone else, getting that fight scene, and yeah, it's definitely worth the time and effort. Being blown up. And then not having any burn marks on me five seconds later, I love that. What I like about 24, I like the storyline, I like the adventure, I like the drama, I like the real life uh, development of the story. 24, what a, gr what a great job. I was working with some real good pros on this, this event. Lubert, of course, the consummate professional. Banneke, of course, we found out during the production, is illiterate. He can't read. He had to speak its line each time. He had to repeat it five and six times. I'm just amazed he's going to get a diploma. I'm, I'm, actually, I'm shocked. And, and his haircut doesn't look nearly as good as mine, as everybody here notices. He's hanging out, put, knocking people out of class. They can go film in the shop room. It's fun. Uh, getting arrested, chased by a car, a cop car, nonetheless. And, uh, just everyone saying, oh, I want to be in, and I want to be in, and be like, no, you can't do it. So, Officer, Officer Masekowitz, what do you think about being in 24? What did you like about it? it? Gave me something to do. Was it fun? It was fun. Uh, it was pretty nice, except these handcuffs are pretty tight. <laughs> <laughs> Not going to lie. How about you guys? Awesome. All right. Job well done. Everybody wave. That good. It was a good time. Uh. So Mike, how, how tight are those handcuffs? They are very, they're tighter than any turtleneck I've ever worn. I'm not <laughs> tight enough. <Yeah. laughs> Alright, your favorite part of 24, Mike. Would yeah. it have to be this? It would have to be this, getting hit by a car and 
cuffed and all that. <laughs> a lot better than sitting in the shop room for the first 10 episodes. <laughs> <laughs> all right. <laughs> so Jessica, what was your favorite part of 24? My favorite part? Um, I don't know. Yeah, that was pretty fun. Riding in the cop car, you know. That was pretty cool. You guys actually left the campus. That was awesome. Yeah, I got you guys pulling out. That was pretty sweet. Of these, man. <laughs> well, now you're done. Yeah. Yay! Now I can get a haircut. <laughs> yeah, you can get a haircut. <laughs> Alright, thank you so much for doing this for us. No problem at all. all right. Uh, my favorite part of 24 was the support cast, which, which supported me, obviously, with uh, Lubert and Wood and Sam Wesselschmidt, some too. And just, you know, hopefully they can maybe get a uh, Best Supporting Actor or Actress award and try <laughs> to hang on to some of my shine, if you will. Uh, do you want to do a second season? Would you, would you like to uh, get more about it? Well, I want to be the bad guy. Are you kidding? Change it around. Mind. Yeah, that'd be good. You gotta have the English. See, what you gotta do is have me versus Pfeiffer, <laughs> two versus four. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Two versus four. Me and Pfeiffer duking it out. Battle of wits, social studies, English. There it's on. I mean, it's started. Obviously, uh, Dr. Wood and Mr. Lubert are key ingredients. Without their roles, without their challenging, uh, the really pushing the envelope on what it means to be a quality uh, actor and really getting into the role. If they would not have done that, I think the 24 would have not been what it was. Well, I finally got to fulfill my dream. Uh, my freshman year, I, I always wanted to do 24 minutes or a style like that. Last year, it used to be we started 60 minutes and that plan failed. But this year, my junior year, we finally had the right people. Uh, Wood and Lubert were in on it, and it, it was such a blast. Uh. Spencer Ernst, really the guy doesn't really know what he's doing. If it wasn't for Holmes doing all the work, I don't think this thing would happen at all. Ernst is, is, is worthless. And, and Eschbacher can't even spell his last name, that's why he goes by Esch. Uh, spanking co-stars is always fun. It's always a joy of mine. Well, we decided since we needed to get as much publicity about out about 24 as possible, I used my resources being in charge of the paper, just had a full page on it to talk about all the work that went into it, all the people that are in it, all the cool stuff like that. I just say this right here, in the beginning, this is way back in, uh, way back in January, February, and we actually got to release this. This was pretty cool. Our advertisement, so this is in the main hall heading to the commons, and we actually get to see our publicity right there. We got, we got the pilot paper, so in 24 we got to advertise it, and it was so cool. And then seeing people's reactions after every episode of play. Obviously, the quality of student acting was superb, um, but I think with, with Dr. Wood and Mr. Lubert really going above and beyond in terms of putting themselves into the roles made the difference. Well, it was hard to watch because I didn't have a full 24 minutes to watch it. So other than that, I really liked it. It was, it was full of action, uh, some real characters, and uh, Filming was wonderful. What I liked best about 24 was the different, all the different situations we were in. It wasn't just like always running through the hallway. We were running, we had a fight scene, we were outside, inside, all the different places we went. Like we used the campus for every part of the show. So it was fun to have it like variety and not just be the same. Um, my favorite thing about 24 was being on camera. I mean, I like doing my lines and stuff, but sometimes Spencer would get mad at me because he'd have to explain it like eight times and then I'd mess up four times, so it would take like 30 minutes to do my scene. But, you know, it was fun. I got better after a while. And, uh, the, probably the best part of the whole show, I'd have to say, probably me. I'm funny, I'm good looking, chicks dig me. I got it all going on. Thanks. <laughs>